I need to realize that 70 is not permitted here. White cast wear. Like, wear. It's been two months. I filmed and I come up here with a nightwear and a scarf because I decided that I'm going to start this new year or this new, what's it called? I'm going to start filming content with at least something I love doing most and that is my skin and of late my skin has been given look at it is it not given i know you know that it's given so i'm just going to be sharing with you guys my morning skincare routine sitting here i'm not even trying to do the aesthetic one I just want to be as plain as possible because if i say people have been asking me my skincare routine you will not believe me but actually people have been asking me my skincare routine and i decided to share with the people that did not ask me funny enough this is a very simple five step morning routine i always talk about your morning routine being as loud and simple as possible you don't have to do too much in the morning and this is here she does what she preach i don't do put it up what i preach so with all that being said hi guys welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel if it's your first time seeing me if it's your first time seeing me pardon the night where we are filming a morning routine and i'm still on my nights because it's money okay if you're first time seeing me do well to subscribe like share comment do this good stuff we youtubers of course ask you guys to do whenever i post a new video and if it's not your first time here hey loves thank you for coming back to another video for me so first step when it comes to your morning routine is of course to wash and cleanse your face and i have a new purchase it's not actually a new purchase but it's something i got during the christmas and it's this simple moisturizing facial wash this is so good i love it so much it is so mild and actually it's written for sensitive skin so it is just the perfect facial wash for me this season and i love it tell me why i decided to film here and i don't have a water it's gonna be wretched so we are just going to wash our face i finally got the water so i always say that we should always remember to wash our hands whenever we want to start a skincare because you don't know the dirt that is and jams in your hands and all and let your hand be wet and we're just going to dab our face a little bit because this product is is so free so we're just going to take like this just a little oh this is actually too much but this amount is perfect for me so i'm just going to lather it in my hand remember the 60 seconds wash or massage anyone do you see how it says soap free that is why it looks like there is no soap but believe me when i say it is doing the actual work So now that the 60 step is over, I'm going to wash my neck in the bathroom just not to wet all this place. So let me go rinse my face and I'll be right back. So if up to now I still have to preach about you having a separate facial towel, then ah, you have a long way to go in your skincare journey. So I'm just going to dab my face, which I already have, and my face is looking all dry and actually really smooth, clear, like i love a fresh skin i love a fresh face like it's so satisfying and up oh. so the next product i'm going to be using is my vitamin c brightening and aging Essence tuna i love this product this is the dr rafael vitamin c serum let me show you guys let me dr rafael vitamin c serum and tell me why i was late in the game this serum is so good like oh my goodness it is so good I, I love it so this is the second step i just do like this remember don't go and do um put your product right on top of your face if you don't want to use your hand you can just keep it from a distance and just do like this because you don't want to carry the nonsense in your face even though your face is clear just going to massage it into my neck and on my face This product is so lightweight, it just penetrates into the skin without any complication, if that's a word. So this is what I use after I wash my face. You may be wondering why didn't I use a tuna slash cleanser, what do you call it? I just love using this for now alone because it has been working so good. And this is actually a tuna and this also contains niacinamide. 
i think i should make a separate video if you want a separate review on this product i will definitely come true all you just need to do is leave it in the comment section even if you don't ask i will still do it because maybe you that watch it may don't want but when i upload it somebody else wants it okay so i'm just going to let this sit in like allow it to sit in like it have actually dried that is how lightweight it is and it penetrates into the skin effortlessly like effortlessly and please don't ask me why it's still in the pack i just don't want the bottle to break my siblings mm -mm, i don't trust them with that one so the next product i'm going to be using is my moisturizer of course it's very important to moisturize if you're not moisturizing your skin i don't know what you're doing but i'm not even going to lie most times i just tend to only use this vitamin c serum i just tend to just use like that but complete skincare routine we need a moisturizer and this simple moisturizer is is so good on my skin i don't know i just love simple product at this point i don't mind them sponsoring me it's speaking into existence so of course we're just going to take a little this is this is how much i need because it's good enough just do like this remember that excess moisturizing is not good over moisturizing is not good though and this is so lightweight oh my god my skin feels so smooth already like my skin feels so alive anything about this simple moisturizer is that it locks in moisture and it penetrates into the skin effortlessly like effortlessly this is not really more of a very detailed detailed product review this is just me trying with you guys my money routine just in case you love how my skin look and you want to know what is working for me remember all skin types are all skin types are different so because it worked for me it doesn't necessarily mean it may work for you with a different kind of skin type i'm combined i'm not oily i'm not dry i'm just in between okay and i'm naturally fair in complexion please as you can see no product here is supposed to bleach you not at all so the next product i'm going to be using is my mary Kay eye cream please the write-up has scatter so i'm just going to just take a little pump this is how the consistency look it is very light a little my mirror is right here a little under my eye and i massage it with in sometimes i do it after my moisturizer sometimes i do it before my moisturizer i don't know but i actually do it most times after my moisturizer sometimes before i have no particular arrangement for it now let's see how we're going to have eye bags before the age of 70 I'm permitted to have eye bags after 70. Anything less than 70 is not permitted here. And of course, after everything that you have done in your skincare, just know that if you don't do this final step, every other thing you did is useless. That's the honest truth. And that is your, is your SPF. The SPF I'm using currently is the Dr. Raphael Anti-Aging Moisturizing Sunscreen. Like, it is actually really, really moisturizing. This is how it looks. This is how it looks. It is so good. And yo dr raphael rachel i don't mind the sponsor though <laughs> so of course the two finger method they're just going to take this as you can see my skin is already looking my friends be like why do i see it like that but it's really looking alive it's really looking bright so this is the measurement for it so just take it like this take a little this is a lot though but just going to make it work it doesn't even know why it's cast just watch out white cast wear like wear so of course the second one i'm sure you people will be like i thought they said two finger i take it one step at a time that way it will be easy for you to blend it in so this is the second one i'm just going to do the same thing but now i'm going to take a little on my neck and then just blend it So do you see how easy it is to blend in this sunscreen like this sunscreen doesn't leave any white cast when i wanted to get it i was so specific i was like if this leaves a white cast on my face i'm not going to find it funny and it's quite affordable i think this costs like four thousand if i'm not mistaken so four thousand but it's small in size like you can see but it's what your money is what your coin is actually very affordable so now that we are done my skin is looking good like you can see it's looking very much good and never forget to never ignore your lips so i'm just going to moisturize my lips hi guys we are done so this is how easy it is to actually achieve a very good skin 
I always say you must not have everything to start a skincare journey. You must not have everything. I, if you cannot afford a facial wash, you can always jump onto any good soap. That's a video for another day, which will be up very soon. But anyway, you can see that the skin is already given. The skin is already giving what it's supposed to give. And yeah, this is all I do most times. I switched up it sometimes. I switched up sometimes. But this is like the major thing I was doing during the Christmas period and January. And it just worked so well for me. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Hope to see you in my next video. Please do to like, share, subscribe. Do those good stuff for YouTube as you guys still do. And I'm sure people will be like, I thought you supposed to change this night to after the skincare routine. Oh, no, honey. Let's end like we started. Bye.